None of this, none of these, none of that. And especially none of those. We got Dr. Dropkick PhD out here, ladies and gentlemen. He went to school for this. This man got his doctorate in, in dropkick. What happened? Did he get good grades? I mean, he got good enough grades to get a PhD. Well, sure enough. I don't know. I, I don't know what kind of grades you got to get to get a PhD. I'm gonna be real with you. Uh, you make a good point. I mean. <laughs> we got the assassin Tommy Italian out here. I'm just I mean, saying, I don't, I don't know. The degree, but does his dropkick look good? Does his dropkick look good? Now, that's a good question. Is it a textbook dropkick? Can you set your watch to this man's dropkick? We'll find out tonight as he takes on the assassin, Tommy Italian. Tommy Italian, of course, has some beef with a one Pola the Bear. Oh, yeah. They have a rematch coming up, so this is a good match. Tommy Italian to kind of get himself together because I'll tell you, the match with him and Polo the Bear will be very stiff. And then Dr. Dropkick missing a couple of kicks there. Yeah, I went with Polo as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, Polo, Polo definitely uh, ooh, tough competitor. Nice neck breaker there by Dr. Dropkick, who is cleaning house here. Goes for a pit really? here. I'm liking the speed of Dr. Dropkick. He's really moving at a pace that Tommy Italian is struggling to keep up with here. It's a couple of toe kicks for your trouble. Now, you got to remember with those toe kicks, they move you forward. Ow. With every toe kick. And my man caught him with a ghetto blaster. Trying to put this man away early. I mean, I can tell that J-Par has been training that. I mean, I've seen J-Par with those educated feet. Mm. Word. But do those educated feet also have the PhD necessary to win with Dr. Dropkick. And Tommy Italian trying to exchange some slaps here, but his arms are not long enough to box with the guard. Ooh, Tommy Italian with a spinning drop to a way back into a pin here. This is a really classic wrestling match here. Mm -hmm. Tommy Italian putting some action out here. Nada. Nada. Who brings the sports entertainment? Penguin Club. I don't even know what that means. Like Chris Jericho style sports entertainment? Like is that what Oh yeah, mean? I mean this, have you seen that boy Jay Blitz entertain? I mean, he didn't look that entertained when Adrian Adams was playing Fair him enough. out. You know. That boy Jay Blitz has a long way to go. Looking pretty promising out here, but still very green here in the True. AWA. I mean, you know, you cannot. I think he's just happy to have more air time. Sure, sure. Definitely. Yeah, he definitely looked that way the way he was talking to the crowd. But one thing you don't want to do is take your eyes off of your opponent, especially when your opponent is Adrian Adams. You know, I'm surprised so how Dr. Dropkick's performing tonight. I mean, Dr. Dropkick has fought Tommy Italian before. He knows. The tricks of the Italian. Oh, look at this. Nice move. Japanese clutch here. Yeah, these guys have fought before here. Dr. Dropkick knows he does not want Tommy Italian to get any type of momentum. There it is. Get him for that step up. Gotta get him the second time. Looks like oh, hold up. No, sir. Oh. Tommy Italian rolls all the way out of the way. He gets That's out the hard. ring. No, not not like that, Dropkick. You're doing so good. Well, you know, Dropkick, he got a bit frustrated there. Tommy Italian was able to move before he got hit with that house call. And that, that was, was almost so it. Oh, yeah. Tommy Italian. That's nice reversal. Ooh, oh, there's a Dropkick, the first one of the night. Ladies and gentlemen, and it counted for. I got to say, that was pretty nice. <laughs> <laughs> that is it, everyone. Wins it with a Dropkick. That's why they call him Dr. Dropkick. All right. I respect it. Okay. Do you feel better about the drop kicks? Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. There you go. JB is a believer. And that man who has a PhD, Dr. Dropkick, Tommy Italian, couldn't really get his foot in there. Dr. Dropkick worked that man over before he got warmed up. It's not looking too, too good for Tommy Italian if he's going to go into that match with Polo the Bear like this. Oh, yeah.
If he's gonna bring that kind of game, you know. Mm -hmm. Call me Italian. That was a that was a really fast match. Hey man, listen, you saw how quick Doc